gone are the days of the dinosaur. But this exhibition is providing a glimpse of their past. Hundreds of visitors have already seen the Days of the Dinosaur exhibition in Johannesburg, an indication of the growing interest in the subject. The turnout has been amazing. South Africa has gone dinosaur crazy. Dinosaurs has been popular 20 years ago and it will probably be popular still in 20 years time. And with dinosaurs come fossils. South Africa is a leader in global fossil research and paleontology. Now, the South African Heritage Resources Agency has designed the National Fossil Sensitivity Map. It will assist property developers, heritage officers and scientists to identify potentially fossil-rich areas. The usefulness of this tool is that for us who are heritage managers, um, developers can have a look at this map and see where, whether their low-cost housing development will impact on significant paleontology and then get the correct people in early on so that there's no damage to the resource. But don't expect to use the map for personal digs. Only those with SARA approved permits are allowed to search or extract fossils. If there's someone wandering around and they see a fossil, they're not allowed to pick it up without a permit. So the permitting system is there to make sure that only people who can read the soil and read the language of the geology can remove fossils. Three more updated versions of the sensitivity map are expected soon. See Gelelwakea, Johannesburg. You deserve to know more. ENCA.com.